Everyone has a resume. Hopefully you have a business card. You've practiced your personal commercial so you know how to network and introduce yourself. But why not set yourself apart from everybody else who's trying to find their next job and maybe very well competing with you. You can develop a case study. Case studies aren't just for Harvard Business Schools. They are a way to elaborate on one or possibly two different accomplishments because no one else is gonna have one. You can also have a professional portfolio. In the old days, it was just people in the artistic community that had a portfolio of accomplishments. But letters of recommendation, your degrees, your letters of appreciation, and your documentation of skills that you developed or licenses that you may have, these are all things that if you carry them into an interview with you, you can provide them to the person or people who are interviewing you as a way to reinforce what your capabilities are. A lot of times you can do that electronically. So you can even carry it on a thumb drive or you can email it to them afterwards and they can look at everything that you've done. It showcases what you brought to the table, and most importantly, what you can do for them. Because most job interviewers who are good at their craft don't really care how you did things in the past unless it gives them an indication of what problems you can solve for them, what you can do to help them grow their business or the company that they're working for. That's what will win you your next job.